What's up, Nursity? East Deanna here. It's winter AF, and I'm sick of it. I'm sure you are too. So today we're gonna go to five Toronto restaurants and bars who bring the tropics to the city. So we're gonna go on a bit of a tapas journey across the city, and I'm super excited to spend the day eating delicious food, enjoying the next best thing to paradise. First stop, we are going to Bar Arena. It's a Mediterranean tapas resto bar. Guys, I love how Barrena has an all-seasonal patio, so you feel like it's summertime, but it's the dead of January. So we ordered two tapas. The first is a lamb shank baklava. Baklava is normally a Mediterranean type of dessert, so it's super sweet, but they've actually paired it with savory lamb, so it's like a really cool combination of taste. Then we ordered the mussel escabesh, which is kind of like a bruschetta, but with mussels rather than tomato. Place number two, we are at La Palma, which is at Dundas and Ossington. If you haven't been here, this place has been Instagrammed so many times, and rightfully so, so let's check it out. So one of my favorite dishes from La Palma is the seared albacore tuna. It comes with fresh watermelon and sumac. It's so refreshing and it's so good. In Toronto, usually in the summer, so get excited for this, you can go on the official tapas journey where you can go to multiple restaurants across the city, order three tapas and a pint of Australia beer just for 20 bucks. Pretty sweet deal, and it's launching in Ottawa and Hamilton this year, so get ready for that. Tapasjourney.com, you can see all the participating restaurants and go to town. So we're here at Barra Restaurant in King West. This place is actually four floors and we're on the second floor right now which is called Pablo's Snack House. So it's currently fiesta hours, so their snacks are five bucks, super cheap. We ordered the fish tacos and they are absolutely delicious. It's actually snowing outside right now, but inside here at Barro it's like Mediterranean vibe, so it's all good. So we're here at Prairie Tell, Ossington and College. It's a super cute, intimate little space. They got this amazing full wall and it's full of house plants. It's really cute. Actually, in a couple weeks, they're gonna turn this place into a free work space. So like a co-working space where you can just drop in, have coffee, enjoy music, maybe get a snack. And then also in the summertime, they're actually opening up a summer patio. So inside our secret, you heard it first. So we're here at Bronco Restaurant. It's a really cute little Argentinian restaurant. It's got super intimate, warm, cozy vibes. It used to be a house, actually, and they transformed it into a restaurant. So if you're looking for a romantic, tropical-themed date, this is your place. They're actually the only restaurant in the city that uses an Argentinian cooking method called Asador, which is cooking their meat over an open-faced fire. All right, so we ordered the pulpo, which is a Spanish grilled octopus. It looks bomb. It's got lemon, garlic, aioli, pickled mustard seeds. It looks incredible. I'm so excited to dive in. Okay guys, I had so much fun stuffing my face today at all the best tropical restaurants across the city. It was awesome. Definitely recommend doing what I just did because it was so good. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned to Narcy's channel for more, and I'll see you next one.